The whole concept of liberation literature was one of Virginia's contributions to the field. She often wrote about slavery and its effects in that era on people who had been enslaved. She talked about liberation literature as allowing the reader to be a witness to the protagonist's suffering and also the triumph. Both the, the protagonist in the story and the reader are therefore liberated, uh, thus liberation literature. I would call her work Manuals of Survival. She called her work Liberation Literature. She took a term that you might think had to do with race, with liberating a people, with being socio-political, with being free, or even a term that might have to do with class. And she took that term and meant the whole mind, the whole soul. That whole sense of portraying the essence of a people who are, as she called it, a parallel culture in, in this country is so important because that history is American history. She was the first African American and first African American woman to win the John Newberry Medal, which is the, the Oscar, if you will, <laughs> of, of uh, children's literature. It's the uh, most prestigious award in the United States children's literature. So she wasn't just talking about a runaway slave that found his freedom or a kid finding the, the psychic route back to, to Africa. She was talking about the way people um, deal with each other and the way they view uh, human experience.